All right, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Ray. Now, today I'm gonna be teaching y'all how to set up the Meta Business Manager. Now, in terms of the Business Manager, when it comes to it, a lot of people struggle with this. A lot of New York clients we have that hop on don't know how the Meta Business Manager works, don't know how to make an ad account, pixel, etc. So this video should clear up a lot of things in terms of how the Meta Business Manager works, in and out, the ad accounts, the pixels, basically just how to have a whole meta suite set up so when we do hop in and run your ads or if you're hiring someone else or you're trying to run your own ads you have that set up i'll be putting this on out on youtube because i'm like why not put out the free value for everyone it's supposed to be for our clients but i'm like you know what let the whole world have some free games so let's jump straight into the video i'm gonna show you guys step by step on how to do it all right cool so getting into it what you're gonna do you're gonna hop on chrome or wherever you are make sure you're on a pc or laptop not a phone or ipad Getting into it, you're going to search up Meta Business Suite. So the business suite is basically what holds everything inside. It's like a house with different things. Inside the business suite, you'll have your ad account, pixel, literally everything, your Instagram account, but you need a Meta Business Suite to even do anything. So we're just going to get here and click on this. Once you're inside the business suite, this is what it's going to look like. All you got to do is click get started. And boom, you want to log in with Facebook. I would I would recommend doing Facebook, to be honest. You, you could do Instagram, but it does get tricky. But you want to just do log in with Facebook. So once you finish making your account or even logging in, this is what the business uh, portfolio is going to look like. So this basically holds everything like I told you guys before. I'm going to kind of explain it to you. So when you hop onto people right here, you could actually go to the top right and invite invite people. You could invite your other account or if you're working with someone, you could invite them. Mainly uh, freelancers use this. However, with uh, agencies, so for example, with us, we do give you our partner code. So all you got to do is click add and basically just put our business ID and you can invite us. However, jumping into it, this is the main part. When you hop into accounts, you will need a page. So let's hop in here. Let's say I'm running a clothing brand, right? Or any type of e-commerce business whatever it may be. I'm going to click add page and then I'm going to click create a new Facebook page. Page, we'll name it Ray Sells Clothes. <clears throat> and we're just going to put clothing brand right here. Clothing brand. And then next, I agree to Meta's terms and service. Boom. You just got to wait for it to load once your page is done you will need the page to actually be able to run ads i'll get more deeper into it after but make sure you do have a page set up and boom page is already done so this is the first thing you need to have your page number two is the ad account so when you do hop into ad account it's going to say no ad accounts found because there are no ad accounts here you're going to have to make an ad account so you click top right add and you click create new ad account i'm going to name it ray sells clothes Time zone, pick whatever you want to pick. Usage, my business, I agree, create ad account. Give it a second, it's going to do its thing. And I believe we have an ad account. So <clears throat> you can assign yourself access right here, manage ad account, assign. So now you have access to the ad account. Now, next thing would be your actual Instagram. So right here, if you just click add, Make sure you add your Instagram. I'm not going to do that right now because I don't need to, but even just for you to know what to do, connect your Instagram from here and you should be good to go. Now hopping in, the pixel is basically what tracks all the data. I believe they switched it off to data sets, but yeah, they switched it off to data sets. It's basically the same thing. So what data sets do is it tracks the data. So in terms of how many clicks you're getting through your Shopify, how many visits, et cetera, it tracks literally A to Z. So what you want to do is click view data sets and... Give it a second to load. And you click add data set right here. Boom. Name it Ray Sells Clothes. You don't have to actually name it that, but whatever your brand name is, you can name it that. But boom, now I have a data set. Now, once your data set's done, this isn't all done yet. You have to still connect it to Shopify. So I'm going to walk you guys through that after. But in terms of main stuff, like you just have to make sure you have your page created. Like I explained before, you want to make sure you have your ad account created and make sure you connect your Instagram. And last but not least, like I told you, would be the data sources. So data set, that's basically pixel. You make that there. I don't know why it didn't make the pixel. That is a little odd. Meta does tend to get a little glitchy here and there, but I wouldn't pay no mind to it. Yeah, it's, it's already made for some reason. I don't know. Oh, I have to assign myself access. I'm so smart. So you just click assign access right here and boom, we're good to go right there. Next, 
hopping in, make sure you go to billing and payments. So if I click billing and payments right here, it'll take me right there. And make sure you add your billing and payment for your ad account for whoever's running it. If we're running your ad account, we're running your ads for you. Make sure you have a payment method added. So it says no payment method. You just add payment method and it'll literally fix that. So once everything is done, I think this is this was a pretty simple walkthrough, even though a lot of people struggle with it and it is understandable. It's pretty simple. Now I'm going to show you how to connect it to Shopify. So I just hopped on one of my test stores right here. What you want to do is you want to go on apps on Shopify and make sure you download Facebook and Instagram. This is what it's going to look like, Facebook and Instagram. Download that app, and then when it takes you to the screen, click Get Started. So once you click Get Started, it'll log you into that Facebook account, and it'll showcase... Well, I have a couple accounts uh, on my BM, but however, it showcases the actual uh, page we made. It's, it's going to show your Instagram mainly, but I didn't connect on Instagram. So it's pretty simple. You just click connect right here. It's going to boom. And it already shows uh, the data set slash pixel we made earlier. And you just click connect right here. I agree. And you submit for review right there. So now what this allows us to do is have the pixel connected. So as you can see, it'll take a couple seconds, maybe a minute or two. It'll connect the pixel, and when we do end up running ads, it'll track every single thing. So it's that simple. You don't have to go and put a code in anymore. It's very simple, straight to the point when it comes to connecting your pixel. I hope you guys enjoyed that quick little tutorial. This is mainly for my clients, but I'm like, you know what? Let's bless everybody up. If there's any, anything else you guys want me to clear up, make sure you comment down, like, comment, sub. I'm about, I'm about to be posting a lot of content in terms of free game on Meta. It's a lot of lifestyle. As y'all can see, I just got a new car. It's right there. I put it as my uh, wallpaper because I love it way too much. But anyways, like I was saying, like, comment, sub. I'm here to help out. I don't sell a course for a reason. I don't sell a mentorship. What we do is we scale brands. If you do want to work with us, you can DM me on my Instagram. It's uh, going to be link in bio at Rain the Dark. So yeah, other than that, Hope you guys have an amazing day, man. Make sure to tap in. Take care.